Milton, Milton, Milton. Oh, Bubby. Oh, God. um, boy, boy. Why are you so bad? Milton, sit. Good boy. Okay, okay. Morning, guys. Full transparency moment. I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm attempting to make a bulletproof coffee. So this is the Dunkin' Donuts caramel coffee cake coffee. And I'm also attempting like the pour over method. I have like a kettle here heating up with water and I have coffee grounds. Like I just don't know how it's supposed to work. But my plan is to pour the coffee through here. I have a tablespoon of butter in here. I'm gonna do two tablespoons of heavy cream, like a half a cup of milk. This is almond coconut. This is just gonna be like the weirdest hodgepodge of flavors, but I'm hoping that it works out. Skinny girl syrup and a tablespoon of collagen. Like, what is this? I don't know, but like, okay. The water just finished, so now I'm gonna attempt to pour it over the coffee thing. I don't know. Oh, the coffee smells so good. Oh my gosh. But I'm gonna go with two heaping tablespoons. Got my boiling water. And I'm going to attempt to pour 12 ounces. I don't know, I don't know how this works. It seems to be working, it's magic. Okay, so seven grams of collagen. I'm gonna go with one ounce of this mocha sweetener. Two tablespoons of heavy cream. Half cup of milk. Give that a shake and let her rip. Okay, since I'm still in recovery and I can't exercise, this exercise is my therapy mug is gonna have to be my exercise. So, pouring it in here. Oh my God, perfect. Oh my gosh. Okay. Here we go. Oh my God, this is amazing. Woo. Okay. So seeing that I don't have anything to compare this to, like I am pleased right now. Like, whoa. So I did 12 ounces of that coffee. I did tablespoon of butter, tablespoon of collagen, two tablespoons of heavy whipping cream, one ounce of that mocha sweetener, and a half a cup of coconut almond milk. Like, who knows what this thing could have ended up tasting like. <laughs> but this is really good, so I'm gonna drink this, I'm gonna relax a little bit, and then I'll check back in. And then the foam at the top, like, makes it like a treat, what? Okay guys, I am back, and here we have my little burger living in its little lettuce house. <laughs> This is bunless burger, lettuce wrapped, duh. I have a tablespoon of mayo, tablespoon of barbecue sauce, one slice of American cheese, two slices of bacon, woo, and some jalapeno and some onion. Like, praise be, blessed be the fruit, may the Lord open. Like, my goodness, that looks great. But what I wanted to do was hop on here and to do a taste test of this self-proclaimed new flavor Powerade Zero, white cherry. I'll be the judge of that. I, mean, I don't know what a white cherry tastes like, but let's see, okay. Okay. Okay, super average. Just just regular, I mean, this is great. I'm gonna drink this. Yeah, but I mean, I can't even rank them. All I can tell you is that blue is my favorite and then the other three just kinda like, you know. This is forgettable to say the least, but I mean, it's exactly what I need out of a Powerade Zero, so I'm gonna drink it. Eating my burger, having my drink, I just realized I haven't had an Atkins bar today, so that's still on the table. Oh my gosh, I have those fat bombs. The world is my oyster, you guys. I have no idea what I wanna do. I'll be back when I figure that out. We just wanna see you. Shake that. Every day I'm shuffling. Okay guys, so a couple of important things. One, I've painted my nails. Can you see? They're silver, like actual silver, which in Espanol is plateado, I'm pretty sure. 
I don't even have my phone to check. So all you Spanish speakers, tell me if I'm right. But I really think that is correct. And gold is dorado, so I do know that. That was the oddest tangent ever. But uh, number two important thing, I don't know if it was that bulletproof coffee or what, but I am just plain not hungry. And not in like, I don't feel good way, like just like, I am like satiated AF right now. So like, I don't really wanna eat. I take that back, as in I don't have any desire to put effort into what I'm going to eat. And that, my friends, means that I am having a Atkins bar. We all knew it was coming. If I can't unwrap it and eat it, it's too much effort. So I'm gonna have this, and then also for health reasons, like because I haven't really eaten anything today, I'm gonna have a Zip Fizz. I don't expect the caffeine to affect me much, but like I need my vitamins and minerals, so that's what I'm going for. I am having blue raspberry today, so that's exciting. Close it. And you know what time it is. Stop what you're doing right now and get your shake on. Oh, 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 oh. Comment down below if you're a real one and you shook with me right there, okay? I mean, depending on where you're watching this from, I get it. But you know, everyone could use a little shake every now and again. You know what I'm talking about? All right, bottoms up. Oh! Oh, I've missed you. Don't get me wrong, man. Bang is good, but like, whoop. Okay, so I'm gonna enjoy this. And then like, I don't even wanna end this video right now because like, what if I wanna eat later? I don't know. Okay guys, I hate to say it, but I'm done eating. What is food? Like, did I even have any today? I have no idea. All I had was that Atkins bar and the Zip Fizz and it was delicious. I don't even want Jello. Zevia, an ice drink, anything like that. Like, I feel great. So I'm gonna stop it here. Just know if you're following along, normally I would have the tuna salad and I even have room in my macros for some green beans and butter, but like, I'm really working on listening to my body and only eating when I'm hungry just so that I can get the most out of everything I'm eating. So I just didn't really feel like having anything else today and that's okay with me. Overall, today was a huge success. I know I've been bouncing off the walls, but like I feel a lot better, but I'm still taking it easy because I know that just because I feel a little better doesn't mean I'm all the way better. Recovery is the number one focus, so that's what I'm doing. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you like it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel, Watch Autumn Keto. I make weekly meal preps, weekly what I eat Wednesdays, and monthly weigh-ins. You can also find me on Instagram at Watch Autumn Keto. Gracias and I'll see you next week.